guys, and welcome to Camo's Place, where we're playing more of the quarry. We're going to make sure we find some tarot cards, if you remember from the last episode. That lady got pretty angry with us for not bringing any tarot cards, so we just got to make sure we stay diligent when looking when we're these guys. Hopefully you enjoy this playthrough as we play the quarry. It's getting more exciting as we work through it, so I can't wait to ha see what happens next. Guys, if this is the first time you've been on my channel, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. But without further ado, let's jump into the quarry. Please like, share, subscribe, do all those things. Okay, chapter three, Trouble in Paradise. Okay, August 22, Abigail, Hackett Woods. Stupid game. What are we in middle school? Why should I even care? Maybe I can kiss anybody. Stupid. Stupid. Great. Where the hell am I? Oh no, no torch. Great. Now I really need to find these tarot cards. I don't know what's around. Oh, that's pretty cool how her head moves to where I move that stick, so that's pretty cool. So, guys, I am playing this on PC. Oh, they took everything from me. Like, why would you be there all alone? something on that tree should I go down this path I feel like it, was, it wants me to go that way oh far out alright that gave me a bit of a jump scare The other way. Okay, can't go any further that way. Alright, let's go. Nothing over here. That way's darker. Checking if there's something I could pick up. Alright. Oh, wait. There's something there. How many of these things are there? Oh, is this another video camera? Okay. What is that? Okay, that noise is the video camera. Where are these tarot cards? That's what's popping in my mind at the moment. Okay. It wants me to go that way, but I'm gonna. <gasps> I got one! Oh, you're cracking me. So it'll be Miss 3. The tower. The tower jump free of your troubles. Fight or flight? That's the question we ask. Ours, or we all ask ourselves. But often when leaping out of danger, we're still faced with a certain peril. Watch your step. Could be your last. Yes, we got one. What a fluke. Now, how, how would you have found that? Like, seriously. Ok, 
Okay, let's go forward. I feel a little bit relieved that we found the tarot card. <laughs> Especially thought that that lady was getting angry at us. Uh oh. Yeah, call back, definitely. Nick! Nick! Abby? Abby? Shout again! I'm over here! Coming! Nick! Nick! Hey. Hey. Um. Hi. You, uh. You ran off. Evasive, too much smoke. Got a little intense. Yeah, be honest. I think that game just got a little too intense for me. I hate... Yeah, I know what you mean. Cautious about what happened. Direct. So you and Emma. Now you'd be cautious. You wouldn't be direct. So, all that stuff back there. Oh my gosh. Emma really wanted to make Jacob jealous, huh? You think? I mean, yeah, why the heck else would she kiss me like that? True. I was just playing along. Yeah. It's just a game, right? Right. Oh, should we? Yeah, go on. Who's this lurking man? <laughs> oh, Nick's falling for her. Oh no. Do you have to do that breathing again? Should we look? No. Oh, they got away. Okay. It's not a bear, is it? Run to camp. Help Nick. Uh, last time we helped someone though, it didn't... Oh my god! Oh. What the... What about Nick? Um, hide, run. Uh, uh, I'm going to choose hide. Oh, 
Okay. Hiding didn't work. Oh, jeez. Uh, climb the tree. Uh, let's just do it. Ah, uh, I probably shouldn't have picked that. Oh, quick time event. I've got to keep pressing it, or... Oh shit! Oh no! Ah, oh, good, I'm not dead. Let's go! Maybe I should have chose run. What the hell is that thing? At least A when it's safe. Ah, oh, this one's got a timer down the side. All right, that worked. Oh no! Oh! Oh, what? Did I release too early? Hackett's Quarry, Kate Jacob. I never wanted starfire. Just don't be flicker like a candle. And it makes me scared to breathe. And if I fall, then I'll be falling into the feet of love's up. He's so upset. He's cutting me so deep. Half the clothes. Now I have to burn the apple. If I wake up. And this game looks good. Technique needs work. Hey. Uh, yeah. I guess you found that. Of course. <sighs> Sneaking down here was a little more fun when we thought we could get caught, huh? Yeah, yeah, I guess. Jacob, I thought we agreed that this, us, was just supposed to be some summer fun. Yeah, no, no. I know, I just... You just love having an audience, huh? <laughs> Jacob. I mean, you I can't believe you you fucking Frenched him! You know, in front of everyone! Jesus wept! French, are we 12? No, but Nick is. Kind of. You know, I love the guy, but I don't think he's actually ever seen a girl naked before. Well, I hate to break it to you, but he just had his tongue down my throat, and he definitely knew what to do with it. <laughs> You, you really love fucking with me, huh? Lighten up, Sarapus, please. This is not how the night was supposed to go. What? You know what? Nothing. No Nothing, never mind. Hey, that's mine. Yeah, well, finders keepers. I'm getting it back tomorrow.
Okay, path Fine. updated. So something you can stand here triggered that. Driving yourself crazy imagining Nick's tongue in my mouth. Oh, or you can go grab us some towels. What do you need towels for? Well, we agreed. Some are fun, right? Apparently, summer is not quite over. Okay. Wow, she's messing with his mind big time. Oh, what? What? What's that thing? You're cracking me. Hey, the star. Ah! Oh. I didn't notice another tower. Oh, look at that. Oh, cool. Oh, it's the star. Stars in the night sky because of light. Dreams of hope, purpose, or a reminder of our insignificance, fear of despair. Trust in the light of the star. When it comes, clarity is sometimes proof. All right, cool. So I'm surprised we've got one behind, but anyway. I didn't notice that. Just, just sitting there, see. We're after towels. I guess we're gonna go up. Not nothing that way. Okay. No towels. Just his luck. No towels. None? There's exactly zero. You dick. What the hell? Just get back down here, Jacob. Hmm. What are these numbers? They're all dates. Show text. So 12th of the 3rd, 16, 24th of 9, 17, 3rd of the 11th, 2019, 29th of the 1st, 2021. Manageable but unstable, unsustainable. Sailing rules. Reminder for counsellors. Keep all boats. Rinse after use. Be vigilant. No swimming. Property store boats to avoid damage. All campers must wear life jackets. If boats capsize, remove kids from the lake immediately. Do not jump in after them. Sail over and retrieve from water. Okay. That might be a hint for something. Ah, binoculars. What are we meant to be? Oh, it's... What was that sound for? She already topless. She's already in a bikini. Oh, not bikini, just underwear. Anything else around here? So maybe each one of these, whenever you walk around, there's tarot cards. There's nothing down that way, so let's go. this huh. 
Oh. It's not long ago. Okay, four months on, hike is still missing. North Kill Gazette. A recent newspaper article about two hikers who went missing in these woods. As of the date of publication, they haven't been found. Still don't know how to get... Anything else from there. But look at that. I think... Okay, the camp store. These flies are promoting a travelling show called Harem Scarum. The date listed indicates that it took place over six years ago. Ah, these are the same as the poster in the woods. Why does Chris Hackett have them? Was he connected to Harem Scarum in some way? Okay. And then let's go up here. This poster was travelling sideshow. It looks like it's been here for a while, left forgotten in the woods. Are those burn marks found around the edges? Whatever these posters are doing in Chris Hackett's possession, I must have forgotten to take them take this one down. Okay. That's it from... The clues must as we keep finding things out. I wonder if it was near here. Okay, so the North Kill Gazette, April 26, 2021. The search continues for Anne Radcliffe and Edward Benson, pictured above, who were reporting missing four months ago after they failed to return from a camping trip. Despite multiple thorough searches of the areas surrounding North Hill, authorities have been unable to uncover any evidence that the two hikers were ever there in the first place. Though a small number of conspiratorialists suggest that disappearance could be some sort of government cover-up, most speculate that they fell victim to an animal attack, possibly a bear or cougar. Local wildlife expert Helen Pratt, however, is certain... This isn't the case, as there are too many inconsistencies when compared with history of documented attacks. Though it doesn't happen often when a bear does attack a human, there are usually quite obvious signs left behind. Blood remains or tall clothes and belongings. Helen went on to suggest an alternative fate for the missing hikers. The local area can be treacherous if not properly traversed. It's far more likely that Benson and Radcliffe were washed into a fast moving rapids. The families of this missing pair, on the other hand, dismiss these speculations, adamant that Anne and Ed were experienced hikers who always prepared for any eventuality when out on trails. They remain hopeful that Anne and Edward are still alive and well, and urge anyone who may have seen them to reach out and get in touch with any information they may have. Okay. That's pretty unfortunate. Just gonna walk around here, see what else is around. What's this? Check it and thack it, huh? Oh, well, check it must mean Mr. H. Chris Hackett. Old camp photo. A faded camp photograph in the 70s, according to the names printed below, two of the boys in the picture appear to be the Hackett's. Who the hell is Thackett? That screechy noise, man. Alright, let's walk around. That, that, that weird noise. Alright, let's go up these stairs. Oh, that's the same ones, alright. Alright, let's go back to her. No swimming without supervision. Alright, no swimming sign. Okay. A handmade sign warning people off swimming near the boathouse, how dangerous it can be. Okay. Yeah, we'll see about that. There's 
nothing else on these walls, was there? Sometimes I wish I could walk a bit faster. Okay, well, I guess we could just like drip dry or you, know, you could shake it out doggy style. Wow, you really know how to talk to a girl, don't you? Look, you can't just pretend that it didn't happen. Oh, but I can because you see, oh, help, help, help. I'm, I'm drowning and I, I need a big, strong, not at all insecure man to come save me. <laughs> Uh, enthusiastic. Cannonball. Ask Nick. Uh, no, jump in. Okay. What's this? A female in need? Fear not, fragile thing, for Hurricane Shake is here! Cannonball! Oh, oh, oh. Cold, cold. <laughs> oh, cold. Oh. Hurricane Jake. <laughs> Oh, okay. Okay, now you're gonna get it. See? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Twitch! <laughs> oh, stop being a uh, grump! Splash. Uh, attack! <laughs> Come up behind her. <laughs> Dick move. Sent to my door. I don't want this to end. Fly it. Take a photo of me. Okay, hey. Look. <clears throat> Check this out. Uh, okay. Take a picture of me. Uh, uh, yeah, for your like, um, little subscribers or whatever, top 10 guys who will keep you satisfied at summer camp. Oh, so I get nine more? What? Don't get cut. Huh? Oh shit, the road on Oh, gotta be fucking kidding me. Dive in, help Abby. Uh, uh, dive in. Because then they're all stuffed. Oh no, hopefully Abby doesn't die. Jacob? Ugh, dick. Oh no. How could he just notice that? Grab. Oh, jeez. Bloated, bloated corpse. All right, chapter three. Bloated decomposing corpse chained to the bottom of the lake. Uh, detangle. Mm. 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 
Ah, fuck, David. Ah, maybe that ring we found helped him. 